guys, welcome back to another reaction video. My name is Riley, that is Nick. Uh, a little bit different here today because we don't have any, a clue what this movie is. Here's what I know. <laughs> uh, Nick knows more than I do, but here's what I know. It, it's called, I can, let me sure I read it because it's so goddamn long. The Man Who Killed Hitler and Then the Bigfoot. Okay, it sounds stupid, right? Hearing it's not. Yeah, hearing Hear, it's actually pretty good. Hear, yeah, hearing it's not. I have not seen a single frame from this trailer. I have not seen any stills. What I do know is it's Sam Elliott. Yeah. And I love Sam Elliott. Like, that stash is is perfection. Big fan of the ranch. Big fan of old westerns. Okay, so Sam Elliott's my guy. And, you know, I feel like Sam Elliott's so respected that, like, he wouldn't take a stupid part. Right. So despite how stupid that title sounds, <laughs> I think Sam Elliott would, would do something good. Yeah. But a trailer came out, so we're, we're going to go and watch it. Let's, uh, let's dive right in. I'll be quiet. We'll share our opinions afterwards. Let's do it. It's a lot of awards. My grandfather used to tell me stories all about this one soldier. As he got older, the stories got stranger. Some I believed, others I don't know. But it wasn't describing a man. Wallet, keys. It was more like something mythic, legendary. You didn't pull any swords from any stones, did you? But you might have done something. Something bigger, maybe. So how have you been? You look a little tired. What's bothering you? Things I could have done differently. Regrets. And I shot someone during the war. I never wanted that. Even if he had it coming. And he did. <laughs> you heard about the killings up north? What's the FBI have to do with it? Imagine all our worst fears about influenza and humans, bovine, swine, all of it coming true to life, only worse. It's the Bigfoot, Ed. They want me to kill it. It's the carrier of this plague type thing. Well, that's no good. If we cannot contain the beast, if we cannot destroy it and it escapes, it could mean the very end of our world as we know it. You're the last resort. Honestly, what? That was awesome. It's a little more serious than uh, than I expected. I kind of like how serious it yeah. is. Did not expect that at all. Yeah, action thriller it's being labeled as. Uh, but, but it seems really entertaining. Yeah, dude, Sam Elliott like, hits me on all emotions, man. Seeing Sam Elliott cry like kills me. It breaks me down. And to see even just that, uh, what we got, like maybe a second, not even, of him in tears there, it hurt a little bit. Hurt a little bit. And the fact that, like, I don't know, the fact that he can, he did all this stuff in the past, but that we're following an older man. I think it's cool that an older man has taken the reins here. I mean, yep. of course, being Sam Elliott makes it more special, but, like, I don't know, there's there's some sense of innocence there, but it's also like, dude, this guy is still a badass after all these years. Yeah, I wonder how how the movie's going to flow. If they're going to do a lot of flashbacky stuff to when he apparently killed Hitler. Right. Or, or if it's just going to be that little glimpse that we saw, maybe, you know, uh, ten minutes tops. Yeah, I kind of feel like you got to show a lot of that flashback. I mean, yeah. they showed Hitler. We, we straight up <laughs> saw Hitler in there. Yeah. Uh, which is neat. It's neat playing with history like that. Uh, but obviously, you know, if you got a name like Sam Elliott, you got to run with it. Uh, so you got to let him be the star, and it, it seems like that's the, the approach they're going to take. Yeah. I mean, I'm super excited for it. Honestly, that that caught me off guard. Did not expect something like that from a movie called The Man Who Killed Hitler and Then the Bigfoot. <laughs> that's cool. Yeah, that's uh, cool. February eighth uh, is when it comes out. Uh, it doesn't say anything about a theatrical release. Uh, from what I'm looking online, you can pre-order the Blu-ray on Amazon, and that's mm. April 2nd. 
Mm. So maybe it is getting a little theatrical run. Uh, it was from some film festivals. Got picked up at some film festival. I was say there was like six uh, festival mm-hmm. uh, claims there. So that, that's pretty neat too. That you know there was a lot of quotes in there saying they, they really enjoy it. It's an American classic, just like that. I don't know it's like taking old school Sam Elliott Western style and mm-hmm. bring it to a very meta modern day approach. Yeah, w- while still adding a little bit. What would seem like a funny twist, but not not done in a funny way. Yeah, the title the title makes it almost seem like a comedy. Yeah, I think honest <laughs> to God, I think that that might push a lot of people away. Yeah, but then again, you also see you read a name that says the man that killed Hitler, <laughs> and, and then, then the, the Bigfoot. Big <laughs> you know, it sounds like a documentary title. Yeah, gosh, I don't know. I'm excited. I think it looks really neat. Uh, but let me let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Are you gonna you gonna order it? You gonna watch it? Uh, I think it's worth checking out. Anything Sam Elliott's worth checking out. Yeah, man. But I think, dude, if he cries, I'm gonna cry with him. <laughs> I seriously, it kills me, dude. Go watch the ranch. It kills me. <laughs> oh gosh. All right, that's the wrap today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure you drop a like and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one. And of course, as always, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.